I'm Nathan Cruz. This is my first time meeting all of you. This is awesome. Um, I'm all about facts. I'm all about getting straight to the point. I'm personally sick and tired. I get physically ill hearing so many people put their ego ahead, short-sighting everybody. And if you say that you're about the kids, then your ego is not going to be the priority. Uh, so I'm not exactly the nicest guy at all times, but I'm dynamic. I focus on the intent of being a bridge builder. I'm all about networking. That, that's something, for example, that Mark and I share in common. We both do it in very different ways. I fully appreciate and back Mark in everything he's been able to accomplish. We don't see eye to eye all the time. Can you speak into the mic? Sorry. We, we don't see eye to eye all the time, but we respect each other for our abilities and our accomplishments. We're, we're not all robots. We're not the same. We all have the same fundamental problems. This is all an injury to ourselves, our families, our friends, our children, and everybody after, like our grandchildren. If we have a dispute, get over with it. Go take it to a playpen and, and go put on your diapers. Come back to business when you're done. You know what I mean? I'm all about get the business and anybody that wants to focus on priorities of putting the children first, I'm happy to talk with you. Um, I've, I've already heard a number of things that each of you are well skilled at that I could bridge you to someone else or I could put you to use some more of my projects. It's not about me. One I could use as an example is how many of you have struggled with work? Employment. Why can't we help each other in that aspect? Why do so many of us watch another parent or grandparent struggle without offering out a hand of some sort? Even without just picking up the phone and say, hey, what can I do? I know another person. That's where it starts. It all starts with each individual. It starts with me. I can't go blaming someone else. If I And the problem. When I tend to go ahead and bust some jewels, the main intent is not to be petty, it's not to cause what so many people call as a division. It's to help you recognize that you're out of line. And it's not from my own perspective, it's let's get to the truth. Let's get to the heart of the matter. Why, why, is there, why do we have a horn on our vehicle? It's like, hey, let, let's bring some attention. This is. You did something that put someone else in danger. It's for hazards. It's to speak up. When evil will always progress when the good don't speak up and they don't do anything. Inaction is an action. So everybody that doesn't get aggressive in fighting against what they're able to see clearly as an injury or dangerous is actually becoming, they're advocating for the evil. And I personally believe that the more people that understand that and grow a spine, the more we can actually follow through with what we say we're after and work together on a united front. Thank you.